Today is Monday, October 22nd, 2018, and here is a brief look at the information security news from overnight. From ZDNet.com, hackers have breached a healthcare.gov sign-up system and have gotten their hands on personal information of roughly 75,000 people. Centers for Medicare and Medicaid Services, who run the website, said that they detected anomalous system activity on October 13th of this year and started an immediate investigation. From ThreatPost.com, researchers have found that a popular Internet of Things real-time operating system, Free RTOS, is riddled with serious vulnerabilities. The bug could allow hackers to crash connected devices, leak information from the device's memory, and completely take them over. Patches have been issued, but may take time for all vendors to install them. From Kaspersky Labs' SecureList.com, Kaspersky Lab said today that it detected computers infected with Dark Pulsar, a malware implant that was allegedly developed by the NSA and was dumped online in 2017 by the Shadow Brokers. Kaspersky researchers said they found around 50 victims but believe the figure was much higher. All the victims were located in Russia, Iran, and Egypt, and their servers were running Windows 2003 and 2007. From HelpNetSecurity.com, Unknown attackers have compromised the official distribution of the Vesta CP web hosting control panel solution to harvest server IPs and admin credentials. The bug was likely released in the Vesta CP 0.9.8-20 update, and the issues are fixed with the 0.9.8-23 update. Update and change your passwords, folks. And lastly, from ThreatPost.com, a novel post-intrusion attack technique allows hackers to hijack a Windows system component called RID, allowing the adversaries to assign administrative privileges to guest and other low-level accounts. The technique is fairly simple, does not require a lot of sophistication. The researcher who discovered the hack notified Microsoft almost a year ago, uh, and they've yet to offer a fix. Head to the Threat Post article for the step-by-step. -step. That's all for today. Until tomorrow, be safe out there.